Ayan, tawagin naman natin si Juni Sorsano, isa sa mga influencers natin na nasa Dubai. Hi, Juni! Hello! Ayan, good morning. Ay, good afternoon na. Uh, past 12 na pala dito sa Dubai. Hi, Julie! Hello! <laughs> Juni and... <laughs> Um, yung question ko una muna with Sian Lim and Julie Sano, uh, Julie Asanose kasi namit ko na kayo dito sa Dubai, you performed na sa sa, sa Dubai na rent. So my question lang is that what is yung pwedeng abangan ng mga fans niyo na a-attend dito sa napakalaking uh, concert event natin sa Dubai Expo. Uh na kumpara Nakita nila how good you guys sa performances niyo sa mga previous mga concerts na natin na, na dito. Pero ano yung bago na pwede lang mas ka-excited dan pa sa 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 darating na, na concert? I think um every performance naman po talagang may pagkakaiba-iba. Mas siguro um mas magiging I don't know, mas magiging exciting kasi for for us talaga since ang tagal din po namin na hindi nakapag-perform ng live with a bigger audience kaya siguro yung excitement po talaga yung magdadala sa mga performances namin um, kaya nakaka-excite nakaka-excite sobra and more than anything we, we we just you know like want to have fun and definitely reach out to our fellow kapuso and kababayans in Dubai mm-hmm. Juni, yeah, Juni, uh, it's it's nice to see you again. And ako naman, uh, katulad ng sinabi ni Julie na it, it's very special para sa amin to perform. And lahat ng performances naman talaga, it's really different. Pero ngayon, it ngayon, this particular one, ng Dubai Expo, it's extra <laughs> para sa amin kakaiba ito because ang tagal nga naming hindi nakalabas. Ang tag- ako, ang tagal kong hindi nakalabas, ang tagal kong hindi nakakita ng ganyang karaming tao. I haven't seen a sea of people in th- two years. So ngayon pa lang, ngayon pa lang hihingi na ako ng paumanhin sa sa mga audiences natin sa Dubai kasi baka pagkatapos ng prod ko, sasabihin ko, do you want more? Pag, pag, hindi, pag ayaw na nila, kakanta pa rin ako. <laughs> you know, but but really we're we're just very thankful for this event. Okay. Ah, uh, meron akong isisingit na question para kay Sir Joseph Francia. Ayan, so sir, uh we would like to know aside uh, apart from our Kapuso stars na pupunta nga po dito. Okay, meron pa ba tayong dapat abangan uh, sa concert na to aside from that? Yeah. Ang uh dapat abangan Juni uh, magandang tanong mo kanina para kay Juni no to me the one difference in this show is malalim ang ibig sabihin ng pagtatanghal na ito kaya yung theme stronger together it means a lot of things to us in GMA to us in GMA Pinoy TV and what we want to share to the world uh, especially in the face of many challenges na Kinaharap natin ngayon, pero yung iba na pagtagumpayan na. To me, it's honoring the efforts, the violent efforts of the UAE government in making sure na mairaos ito. Walang, di ba? Pangalawa, yung pagtutulungan ng Filipino community and with the government and private sector at yung mga uh, various groups to, to ensure na successful ang ating participation sa isang global event na ganito. Hindi araw-araw na nangyayari yan. Tapos, we want to honor the the participation of the huge Filipino community in the UAE in ensuring the success of the Expo. And then, ano pa? Stronger Together means showcasing the talents of three of our best stars from GMA. As I said kanina, uh, they represent the values that we'd like to share. To, to the world. Si Julia eloquently articulated what they want to say. Si Jessica represents the Cebuano-speaking community, represent and the talent that uh, we are able to draw from uh, from shows like The Clash. Diba? So her story itself is an inspiration to me personally and to us at Jamie Community TV. And that's one of the things we looked at. 
si si uh, siya naman represents inclusivity uh, before she's pro- he probably did not think that one day he will be in dubai wearing a gma hat but look at look at what happened in a span of two years he is part of this group and i'm i'm very gratified personally at the energy and the chemistry that i've seen over the last hour na first time nila mag uh, di pa sila nagkikita-kita in person but i'd, I'd, yeah. I'd like to see that working together stronger together being represented on stage to share uh, their talent with, with everyone in at the Dubai Expo and not just to the Filipino community which i think will represent a huge part of the audience but this is a global event after all 190 plus countries represented we hope to get the attention also of the non-pinoys uh, because a yeah. lot of foreigners are as you know you are a very international community in Dubai, especially the Expo. So I'm sure pag narinig nila yung mga kantahan, I hope they pay attention and stay and say, oh, what's that coming from the Philippine show, right? So Ayun. I hope you capture that, Junie. Abangan ko. I hope you get, share with us what the feedback would be, both from the Filipino community and the non-Pinoy community. Yes, definitely po. Ilalabas natin yan online uh, right after the event. Pero All sir, right. uh, just a, a follow-up question sa inyo. So it means that ito na ba yung sign that you guys were going to send more uh, Kapuso stars abroad parang to perform? Yes, uh, okay, okay, okay na dito. Sa was, it is a sign. Uh, maraming uh, natutunan over the last two years uh-huh. on how to manage the new normal, the next normal. Right. So I think uh, Dubai, rightful place for us because I, I think you're one of the countries that's showing the world on how to navigate, on how to manage the pandemic. And uh, you are successful in doing that. Marami kaming matututunan sa experience ng UAE in doing events like this. Look at this. Uh, in the midst of the pandemic, we're able to pull off the biggest expo ever, right? So, uh, the protocols na ginagawa ninyo, ako, ako mismo na naranasan ko kung gano kayo kasino in terms of testing, monitoring, and safe uh, practices in uh, Dubai and the, at the expo grounds. I think there's a lot to, to learn. And even now, as you work with the Expo technical team, um, my team at Jamie Pinoy TV is learning a lot. Uh, you certainly have elevated diba? the, the standard on how to face the crisis, not just to survive, but to, sabi no, ano, not just to survive, but to thrive. Mas ano pa, one step better. Maraming natutunan eh. Na, na-capture yung learning from, from the crisis. Uh-huh. Uh, napakalagang lesson uh, palagay ko niyan para sa ating lahat. Correct. And we are excited with this uh, project talaga na ginawa ng GMA Pinoy TV. Um, thank you, sir, for your answer. Ang, ang next naman I have for Jessica. Ayan. So, yes, uh, so, so Jessica kasi, uh, I'd like to know if this is your first time to travel to Dubai. Yes po, it's my first time. Mm-mm. Okay, kasi of course, Sian and Julian, they've been here for a couple of times na. Pero you kasi as first timer na dadalaw sa Dubai or sa United Arab Emirates, gusto ko lang malaman, uh, ano yung mga plans mo pa after, let's say, with this big event na concert na gagawin nyo? Uh, ano yung una mong, or top, sige, give me two, top two of your, ano, uh, of your, plan na pupuntahan or dadalawin dito sa Dubai? Um, actually po, wala po talaga akong exact place kasi as in, ang yung Dubai first time ko talaga sa international mag-perform. So, wala po akong exact place na pupuntahan. So, <laughs> siguro yung malin yung amphitheater po yung pupuntahan. So, <laughs> Sige. Sige, ka namin. Kami nang bahala sa'yo kapag nandito ka na. <laughs> Itutour ka ni Joni. Oo, is kasama sa'yo. Oh, oh, wala po talaga akong alam dyan po, no? Pero I'm very excited <laughs> po to see Dubai. Ano, Jessica? Alam, Dalin ka namin ka sa, sa desert. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Tapos masasakin ka namin ng camel. Camel no? po. Ayan nga. Gusto ka-try yun. Yun lang po. Madami po daw kasing camel dyan. So, 
Sa- sana po makita ko po sa personal no ang camera. <laughs> <laughs> Ayan po. Okay, sige. So, baka we will also have a, a chance din na pwede kang makakain dito ng camel meat. So, we will just help oh, you yeah. off kapag nandito na kayo. <laughs> anyway, ito na lang question ko for for everyone, uh, Julian, to Zian, and to uh, Jessica. Ang Dubai, ang Dubai Expo concert kasi, malaki talaga siya. Okay? So, Filipino crowd, to be honest, just to give you a feedback, every time na may mga concert na na, na for Filipino doon, Filipino artist, alam mo bang apiktado yung ibang businesses sa ibang side ng Dubai? Because all Filipinos are really uh, ano going there. Nandun lahat. <laughs> okay? So, ibig sabihin, ganun kalaki ang crowd ang Filipino doon. Plus, napakadaming other nationalities din na nandun. So, my, this is just my last question. Um, ano din yung piniprepare nyo naman for non-Filipino audience that might be there on that concert? You mean sa, ano po, sa mga repertoire po namin? Mm-hmm. We also, ano po, we also uh, prepared po mga songs that people can relate to. Um, mga, mga songs po na mga, ano, na mga international artists then So, para naman po, alam mo yun, like, maka, makasing along din sila. And I'm pretty sure that everyone will, will kapag uh, nandun na po kami sa mismong uh, performance, sa, sa, sa stage. Kaya we're very, very excited and we just want to have fun. Mm-hmm. Okay. I think that says it all. So, see you soon dito sa Dubai. Thank you so much. Thank you, Juni. Thank you. Oh, Si Juni na ang bahala sa inyo pagdating niyo dun sa Dubai. Oh, yung po, ah. Jessica, yung camel daw. Juni, Desert sa... Safari. Oh, my yes, God. Yes. Oh, ah. <laughs> Salamat ulit, Juni. Thank you. Bye-bye.